Hi, this is Vincent and I am the team leader of Avera production unit. Let me take a stride route to explain the technical specifications of Avera Retrosa 2. And mainly Avera Retrosa 2 is the fastest and first electric scooter in India. So coming to the technical specifications, the main aspect here is motor. We are giving the most powerful and efficient 72 voltage Bosch Bosch motor with the energy of 3 kilowatts. We are giving the most efficient motor that is 72 voltage Bosch with the energy of 3 kilowatts. It will give it will it will move the vehicle with the maximum torque in forward direction. To withstand that forward direction, we are using the new technology to retard that motion. We are using braking braking system with and we are using dual disc with dual caliper and also dual brake lines and the main interesting fact is that whenever we apply any of the brake either front one or rear one then both will act at a time and it will make the vehicle more stable without any skidding experience and coming to the suspension of the system we are using telescopic suspension system here and it will absorb the force very effectively and it gives the better experience for the rider and rear side we are using mechanical suspension system and and it also will give the driver with better experience without experiencing any back pain or it will absorb the energy in effective way and also another interesting fact is that we are giving this one thermal seat Whenever you say, whenever you see in our, in another vehicles, you may experience heat. That is, we are giving this different kind of leather. It does not absorb heat from the sun. And also, some more we added up some more features. First, whenever we turn on the vehicle, parking mode is there. We have added up some more features here. Whenever we turn on the vehicle, parking mode is here. Firstly, we have to release that parking. Firstly, we have to release that parking by pressing that. Then vehicle will start. Then we can see here, we have introduced four gear systems here. Economy, Drive, Sport, and also reverse so coming to the economy mode we can go up to 35 kmph and it have given a best experience and it gives the mileage 140 kilo 140 kilometers and in drive mode we can go up to 50 kmph and in sport mode we can go up to 90 kmph and also some more electrical features are there four-way parking four way parking it will helps the people who are coming from other vehicles they may know that vehicle is in parking condition and also headlamp this one daylight we have introduced this system to know the people who are coming in the opposite direction that the vehicle is moving from opposite direction to avoid collisions and this one headlamp this one high beam low beam signals left signal right signal this one horn and also one more interesting feature is that we have introduced USB port to charge our electronic gadgets. We can charge our mobiles here. And also to accept some ergonomic principles, we have introduced footrests here without bending our waist to do not remove with our hand we can easily take it by our own foot
and we have introduced the reverse mode here the main reason for introducing this reverse mode is it will help the indian women to move the vehicle in backward direction in terrain regions for easy handling feature is that we are using side stand sensor and brake sensors also the main function of side stand sensor is that whenever we put on the stand sensor will activate and it will make the vehicle do not go in forward direction mainly it will help in our daily life for our children in 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 sometimes children will play with the vehicle by accelerating the accelerating throttle then vehicle will go by using this sensor vehicle will not go in so vehicle won't go in forward direction so conclusion of this vehicle is as we compare it with another vehicles another electric vehicles we are giving more speed more torque and also more mileage and also we can control pollution in our daily life and we can save earth and also we can save some money which we are spending on petrol as we know that petrol prices are hiking day by day